everyone and welcome back to my channel. We're going to do another shop with me today. I'm off out for lunch with a friend first and then on the way back we're going to swing by TK Maxx and have a little look in store because I love browsing TK Maxx and I went there recently and picked up some real treats. So I'm a bit sad I didn't vlog that for you but I'm going to go to a completely different one as I'm going further out for lunch today. I thought I'd take you to a different TK Maxx I haven't been in in a really long time. So we're going to go and see what's in store and do a little bit of shopping. Let's go. So this is the TK Maxx we're gonna go into today. It's a lovely sunny day. It hasn't been this nice in so long. Yeah, it's been chucking with rain for like days, so it's really nice to be out and about. And I'm gonna grab my face mask and my bag, and we're gonna go and have a little mooch. Now it's always awkward shopping and vlogging. Um, but I haven't been in this one for a while. We're going to go and see what's in store. I do things in a very methodical way normally. So I'll always start like beauty skincare stuff. And then I sort of zigzag round um, into clothing and homeware shoes. And um, I like to look out for the pet bits as well as I've got a little dog called Bonnie. And if you're new around here and you haven't subscribed yet, please do click subscribe. I make videos about home, lifestyle, travels, Disney and everything in between. So please do click that subscribe button. I'd love to have you here. But yeah, let's go and store and um, I'll try and vlog some clips. If I have to do a voiceover eventually, then I'll have to do that. But let's go see what's in. Oh, this is going to be a nice TK Maxx shop because I've not been in here for a while. But we've got Lizelle moisturizer and... Oh, that one's another moisturizer for dry skin. And then down here I noticed Cow Shed. I don't think I've tried any of their products before. Mm. Oh, we've got a Cleanse and Hydrate Essentials kit. Lizelle. £40 was 50 I only need hot cloth cleanser though, I don't need everything else. Ooh, this is another brand I really like. Magnetone. I wonder what that's like. How much is this? This is, oh my gosh, originally £60, now £14.99. Wow. They've got quite a few Australian brands and there's some really nice bath salts. I've tried West Lab a few times, I like that brand. They've also got this really nice gift set of $5.99. I found a really nice Anastasia Beverly Hills makeup brush. Um, I don't really need a new foundation brush, but I've also found by Terry Foundation that was originally £48, now £16.99. But I don't know what shade I am. They've got Tangled Teaser in here. They are one of my brand partners. I love them very much. And they actually have one of these smaller blow drying round tools. That looks quite nice. I own most of the Tangled Teaser brushes, but don't have that one. Guys, handbags are my weakness. I love looking at all the handbags next. I really like this little Ralph Lauren side bag. This is, well, originally 67 now, 24 99 Right, we are going down the side here, and then it seems like it's shoes. So we'll have a little look. Ooh, I did want to get a skipping rope bit random but I used to have one and I lost it. I've got one of these lights in my office and I found mine in B&M but just thought I'd show you because they do have one in here and it's 12 99 It's pretty good to be honest. Oh my god they've got Javianas. I love Javianas. These are my favourite flip flops and these are the Lunas. They're my favourite ones. It's a princess thing you wouldn't understand. <laughs> Amazing. I'm on the hunt for some new white trainers and I quite like these. They're quite nice, aren't they? They actually have quite a few good shoes. I know we don't need any luggage. I mean, most of us don't need any luggage because we're not going anywhere, but for any of you that are maybe going anywhere, they do have some good cases in. Look at that one. That's so pretty. I love these little ones that fit on the top. So you have like a matching case. Oh, I love suitcases. I don't know what it is. I just love luggage. I was just walking past the men's shoes and they've got these nice Levi's. Levi looking Converse. Uh, how much are they? $24.95? Right, we're gonna have to look at what dresses they've got in for spring, summer. That's quite pretty. What else have we got? Little flower dress. No, no. That's kind of cute, probably too heavy though, like hot for summer. Mm. Oh, whistles. Let's have a look at this. Mm. It's a maxi, no. Oh, 
French connection. That's quite pretty, isn't it? Would that look nice for a wedding? It is it was originally £185, it's now £44.99. Oh, it's a UK 12, that's a shame. I'm actually going to move that into the size 12 section so somebody can find it. There we go. So last time I was in here, I actually bought this white coat that was 30 quid. It was an absolute bargain. And I also bought, I just went past it. Oh gosh, I should have just got it ready. I also bought this top, this Ralph Lauren one, which I love. This is a bit pricey for a t-shirt, but I love it so much. I have it in white as well. I bought actually from Ralph Lauren. Um, so just having a look through the t-shirty bits. Oh, Zara, that looks tiny cute though i don't really know what i like anymore so that's why i quite like tiki masks because i can just have a little rummage <laughs> they do often have disney bits you can sort of rummage out but that's a medium it won't fit they've got a lot of this brand chelsea piers i bought from them before this is a really nice jumper it says perfectly imperfect it originally was 38 pound now down to 20 and i've also found some more disney this one this one says love Mickey. I don't need any more Disney hoodies, but I just thought I'd show you what they've got. Oh, there's another one. Cute, isn't it? Oh, so many. Quite enjoying this. <laughs> this is not the best TK Maxx I've been to, but um, we are going upstairs. First. Home floor. <gasps> Exciting. Ooh. We have uh, an electric lighter for our candles, but these look really cool in the boxes like this. Oh, candle accessories. That's fun, isn't it? What a nice gift for somebody, like a new home gift. They've also got Zara Home car fragrance. That you sort of, oh, they stick in the um, air vent bit. How much are these? 2 99 we're eight pound always look in the card section because you do need to rummage a little bit but they've got some really lovely cards that i don't always see in the supermarket some of them are really funny and quirky and just worth a look basically is what i'm saying i don't need this on my desk oh do i oh i really like it look at these little drawers and these little divider bits really like this but why do I like this I don't need it I've just spotted these amazing Ray Dunn little 7.99 boxes what do they say storage and organize oh I'm having those these are really nice little storage bins they have little lids got no need for them but 5.99 and then also they've got the really nice Joseph Joseph we have the toothbrush version of these in plain white like this i like this organize your bathroom essentials but we have cupboards obviously so don't need that but like it they got it in blue and then white amazing like makeup storage things We've also got these plastic things that are quite good in bathrooms and then also i wanted to show you they had these really cool looking bin things that you can sort of stack they'd be really good in like a utility room or a storage room i quite like the idea of this but i've got nowhere to put it at the moment these mirrors are amazing i absolutely love that i have nowhere to put that but i love it oh so nice they've got loads of little like side table things here are really nice i love tiki max so much i could spend all day in here this would be amazing if you had a barbecue in the summer and you put loads of ice in there and had like a drinks bucket oh look at that adorable jules dog bed it's too small for bonnie but oh my goodness that is so sweet oh oh my god they have princess crown ones Oh my goodness, that's incredible. They've got some really nice, um, <laughs> this is going to sound ridiculous, lavender scented poo bags, dogs, um, that are nice and thick. Hmm, extra wide, extra strong and easy to tie. Okay, obviously I haven't done kids or men's because I don't need those things today, but 
I think we've got to go home because we've got a full trolley and it's getting out of hand. So let's leave. I do not care to admit how long I was in there for. We have a big bag. I'm home and I've just been playing with the dog and she's proper panting because we've been throwing a bone around. But, oh, I've got this massive TK Maxx bag to show you. The bag itself was £1.29, which is not too bad, a bad bag. Bad, actually, for one of these massive reusable bags. We use them for so many things in this house. So, let's start with the first thing, a new yoga mat. This was £12.99. It's a generic sort of mind body soul yoga and fitness um, mat and i'm actually using this more for my workouts in our kitchen the floor is so slippy i need a mat down and i did have one and then uh, about a week or two ago bonnie had a little accident and had a little wee on it so i did try and clean the old mat but it was it was old and cheap anyway so i just thought oh, i'm just gonna get another cheap one from tk max 12.99 can't go wrong if anyone knows really good yoga mat companies or like ones that you really recommend um then let me know but i'm not going to keep this one down on the floor now i've learned my lesson <laughs> speaking of the dog i did pick up those poo bags this is actually a canadian company never stop wagging earth rated lavender scented poo bags these were 3.99 for how many do you get 120 it's just such a boring purchase but when you see them out you just you know you've got to get these things so got that the next thing i picked up was a joseph joseph caddy for the sink now i've actually had one of these before in white and green and i think we left it at the old house because it didn't match the new house or i don't know what happened to it maybe we threw it in the end or whatever i liked it a lot and um the current caddy we have i bought from did i also buy that one from tk maxx either way it's not big enough um so i wanted this one and i've had this in the past obviously so i knew it was perfect because i've got like a minky cloth and then the washing up liquid and the and the brushes and whatnot so yeah got one of those and this was originally 22 pound but i paid 12.99 for it which is still expensive for like what it is but a lot of our kitchen is this joseph joseph brand and i just love it i love them a lot i own a lot of their products next was a bit random but i saw the brand bin buddy who do basically like these shake um things that you shake in the bin but i also saw they did a spray version i thought that could be quite handy for um cleaning the bin inside and out um leaves the bin smelling nice this was two pound 20 in had like a red sales sticker on it um it was one of those things that you just think yeah we need that clean the bin next i picked up the baskets i showed you from ray dunn i don't know what the original price was for these but they were 7.99 each and I just thought they'd look really nice somewhere in the house. I'm actually thinking our new utility room when we finish renovating it. But we've got one that says storage and one that says organise. This is the American spelling of organise with a Z. Um, however, I really like this. Ray Dunn is an amazing, really lovely um, brand. And I just thought these were nice little baskets. Also, we're now in the season of using... Um, sunglasses as hair accessories and I'm here for it love them I got two items of clothing this dress they had some brands in there that you don't always see they had like Oasis Warehouse Zara and this one was Oasis um, and this was originally I don't know the original price actually but it was $14.99 in TK Maxx you would never pay that in Oasis for this but it's a midi dress and it's got like a leaf print black with green leaves on it i don't know what this will look like um but i thought i'd give it a go i thought this would look really nice for spring summer i do not like this on this placement of this like bird just looks a bit strange there it just feels a bit too tight i'm not wearing a bra and i would want to wear one with it the sleeves are elasticated and they feel fine but they are just like I'd rather they weren't elasticated and it's just pulling too much you can sort of see my skin there so this one sadly will have to go back but it is a very pretty dress it is the sort of thing you'd wear on like a holiday though maybe not in the UK so 
yeah this this we're not keeping this one sadly the other piece of clothing i bought was a jumpsuit and this was also by oasis wow i didn't realize they were both oasis see i'm clearly drawn to the same company um this was 16.99 and i basically have a jumpsuit that is exactly like this in green from next and i love it i live in it because it feels like pajamas um and i just think i'm gonna absolutely love this if this fits on me oh i'm gonna this is gonna be the 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 thing i'm wearing all the time this is the jumpsuit on i absolutely love this it just feels really comfortable you can't wear a bra with it because of the back but i really love it, it feels really nice oh this is just gonna be so perfect in the summer i like the little belt too but to be honest you don't even need need it really but adds a little something something but i love this crossover the straps are just too so i just need to play with that a bit but it's got pockets yes 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 this is a win the original price is in here 46 pound 46 pound it must just be like old season but i obviously paid 16.99 so i think that was that was quite a good good buy next i picked up the havianas these were an absolute bargain they were half price basically so 20 pound but i paid 9.99 and they didn't have many in my size because I'm a USA 7 slash 8, which is a European 39 slash 40, um, so which is a UK size 7 basically. I'm about a 6 and a half, 7, but this is what I am in the Havianas. And I just saw these and I thought for a tenner, I'll pick them up. I know I'm going to get a lot of love and wear out of these. They are just an amazing pair of flip flops. They're my favourite flip flop brand. If I can ever have a favourite flip flop brand, then this is them just brilliant so yes and i absolutely love the lunar ones which have got the backs to them but i know that these are just i'm gonna get so much use out of them they're just gonna match everything so had to get those some miscellaneous stationary bits my friend bianca is moving to a new home in brighton she's moving from london to brighton she's actually my co-host on our podcast the online offline if you haven't listened to it check it out link is in the description bianca is also a twitch streamer and you can find her on twitter and instagram and whatever she's amazing i love her she's one of my best friends and so i wanted to get her a little new home card and as i said you've got a hunt in those card sections and i found this one and she loves cats and she's going to be getting a little cat so i just thought that that was a perfect little card it says new home with the little cat on the chair. This was originally £4, but in TK Maxx it was £1.99. Um, and yeah, I just loved it. Look at the um, envelope as well. It'd be really nice when it um, arrives at her new place. Next, I picked up some pens. I saw these metallic pens, eight shimmery colours. And I just thought they'd be quite nice in my planner. They were originally £8, but I paid £4.99. So you don't always see nice pens and brands in TK Maxx in the stationery bit, but there was a really good selection today in the one I was in, so I picked up those. And then I also saw these, they are fashion dry eraser markers and they have a built in eraser on the end. Um, but I have a glass writing board in my office and in the kitchen. But I thought these could be quite nice in my office if they work on my board, I think they will. Um, intended for dry erase surfaces only i think they will work on the board if not then i will pass them on to a friend that has a dry board but um i just thought i'd give them a go for 2.99 they're just really nice colors and at the moment i only have bog standard red blue green and black so i just thought this would be quite nice to you know jazz up my glass writing board then last but not least we're gonna do the beauty things so i picked up this the natural goat's milk company made in australia body wash with coconut that was 4.99 don't know the original price um but i did sneakily open it up and had a little smell and i could smell it through my face mask oh it smells incredible i saw this by a company called aunt jackie's curls and coils and it said frizz rebel coconut and sweet almond um it's basically like an oil i think and this was 3.99 i have not heard of this brand before um but i do get really frizzy hair especially on the top um so i just thought that could be quite good to pop through my fingers and then hopefully help the frizz i'm not sure i've tried lots of different oils and products but I thought I'd give that a go. It sounded like it might smell nice too. What does it smell like? I didn't try this one. I didn't buy this today, but I did buy it in TK Maxx the last time I went. This was $5.99. I've bought this to send to Blair Lamb, who's another YouTuber. She is pregnant with her second baby, a little boy. And because her surname is Lamb, I saw this little onesie. <laughs> 
<laughs> that has little lambs on it. So I got that one a couple of weeks ago, actually, along with a couple of other baby bits. I've sort of started collecting, so I've got three friends that have had babies or are having babies. And so I've got a lot of baby clothes hanging in my spare room. The sunlight is going. The dog needs to go on a walk. I'm going to put all this stuff away. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching. And I will see you again in the next ones. Bye.